Hi folks, Robin here. We're up in Tindrum for a Munro completion, which is on Stop Gower and the Black Mount Munros. Unfortunately, tomorrow it is an atrocious weather forecast. Absolutely minging. We've got rain, wind, actually seeing gusts up to 70 mile an hour. So we're talking about leaving at nine o'clock and try to get up to the summit as quick as possible. But uh, it's going to be fun anyway. So I'll bring you back tomorrow morning. Animals went in two by two. There we are. There's a wee bit of whiskey in there. Oh. <laughs> Get it quick! Oh, you're right. Right, so we've been going just over an hour now. We've passed the What's the Clash Giller farm? We're taking the longer but safer route. This is Clive here. He's Hello. completing the Munros today. Clive, how do you feel? Ah, oh, pretty exhilarated. Yeah, quite yeah. excited about it. Uh, it's nice to have everyone together, but you know, it's all the people I've walked with over the last 10 years. Many. How long has it took you to get uh, to this point? I think it's about 11 years. 11 years, that's not I think I've done one before that. Uh -huh. so I'm not going to count that one. But. <laughs> and what's been your highlight of your Munro round? I think, I think it's Noidart's been, I really like it, Noidart. Oh, yeah, Just been there again, and done the Munro's again there. But that was a brilliant trip there. Did you not actually meet somebody quite <laughs> special during your Munro round? <laughs> yeah, well, one of my favourite trips was in Torridon. <laughs> uh, I thought I'd better get that I in met, in case she watches us. <laughs> yeah, I met, uh, I met someone called Ruth in Torridon. And, uh, yeah, that was a pretty special day. Uh, about nine years ago. Well, probably years. longer, longer actually, to kill me because I think it's probably yeah. nearer 11. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, yeah, she's been the catalyst for me to to finish my round actually. So this track here goes up, kind of boomerangs a bit, and takes us up here, and then this is the first stop here we have to go over. I've got my doubts we're going to make it. The wind's starting to pick up now. Spirits are still high though. What do you reckon, Davy? Oh, getting there. No top to head over, and then hopefully we should get to the true summit. The wind speed was touching 35 miles per hour. If it stays around that, we should be fine. So this here is the Munro top. We just wound up Clive. He fell for it for a few seconds. <laughs> oh my God, that was tough. Let me tell you that. I never made it to the summit. A few of us didn't actually. What happened is we got to a, a small Munro top, um, and the wind the wind was was actually fine there. And then we dropped down, and then we're on this sort of connecting ridge up to the Munro, and the wind started to pick up, and it was touching between forty and fifty miles per hour. 
Uh, I thought it's okay, we can manage, you know, it's fine. And then just before the Munro summit, we're on the boulder field and the wind was starting to hit 60 miles per hour. I was like, no, I'm not continuing. Uh, it's too dodgy. The, the boulders underneath were slippy. Um, the wind was catching you by surprise. You were getting moved. Uh, it just wasn't safe at all. So Clive pushed on with a few others. They touched the top, a few foes, and straight back down again, all headed back down together. Guys, guys. You only need to be at the back at the end. And that's what I did the whole bloody time. There's one person I should uh, Look at the thank a little bit. <laughs> and obviously without uh, I would never have ever done. Um, <laughs> 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 Molly. Molly stack, uh, Rachel, so. <laughs> yeah. 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 We met ten years ago in the Tour of the Youth Hostel, and then we met on the top of Ben Alligan the next day. And I cooked for her, actually, that night, because I was with this man and Tim over there. And so we haven't really looked back since. Well, we have. We split up a few times. <laughs> 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 Idea. So, we haven't got much spare paper. What's your favourite day? I feel like this is number two, so. Number two. I reserve judgement, yeah. I'm on number three. Number one's my favourite so far. Exactly. What we're going to do is we're going to take out the one that won, and there's going to be four left, and then the next round you've got to vote for the one you, you dislike the most. Number four. <laughs> number three. Right, so well, that gets so decided number one's the best, and we'll take that down to our table now then. No. <laughs> 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 so you 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 number one is the winner. Yeah. What is it? Right. Yeah. 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 Right. Let's say alright, let's have some guessing. Single Ocken 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 that's a good Where's call. Welsh. <laughs> Welsh. 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 Welsh.